I got this traffic advisor light bar to try out and give my honest opinion on it. So let's go ahead and take this thing out of the box and see what it looks like. All right, so I have the traffic advisor sitting on my back seat back here. And if you can see, I have it plugged in. There is a switch there that you need to turn. I turned the switch so the little red light would come on. So the switch is turned on. So it's providing power now to the light bar, which is here. And then here is the control board or the control panel that runs this. Now to turn it on, you just hit power. And right off the bat, I think it starts with the one you last had set. Got three main ones here, left, both directions or right. And then it has custom. So you can make your own custom ones. And then it's got pattern. Pattern lets you flip through just, I think there's 29, I think different signals. Let's see, 23, 24. So there's 26 different patterns that you can run through. And then there's 27, 28, 29. And then you can just turn the power off to the bar. And when you turn it back on, it comes back on to 29. Now, my windows are slightly obstructed by these headrests. I can pop them down. And then I have my Merca sticker right there. So I'm still going to put the suction cups on the back window so you can see them through the window. But I think when I use this, I'm actually going to stick it with these suction cups backwards and I'm actually going to stick it on the outside of the truck window so that way it's very easily noticeable it's on the back of the truck and then I'm just going to operate it through the door or through the sliding glass. Of course if it's raining something like that you know I'll probably put it inside but let's see what it looks like on the inside. So even with the very dark tint and even the sticker you can still see the light so even if your back window is tinted and you want to stick that on the inside, you're fine. Maybe the stickers on the back window might interfere with it. Like I said here, I've got that America sticker right there and it kind of blocks out some of it. But honestly, I think if I would be using this on a daily basis or if I need someone's attention, I'm going to stick it on the outside of the truck. So let me show you what it would look like if it was stuck the way I'm talking about. So these suction cup adapters on the sides can be flipped whichever way you want. Right here, this one's a stationary screw. And then this screw, when you loosen it, it lets you angle the light bar. Well, you can flip this entire bracket the other way around and it goes on just the same way. Of course, you could always put it on the outside like that. If it's not raining, that's probably the most obvious way of doing it. Of course, I'm gonna be using this most likely in my farm truck. So it has just one big glass pane, no sliding window, no stickers, no nothing. But yeah, all in all, it does exactly what you want it to do. It gets people's attention. So hopefully they don't run into you or run over anybody around you. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, if you would do that, that really helps us out. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Y'all take care.